Does the word toxic create a very specific image in your mind? Do you think of a friend, a parent, or an ex? Sometimes it's hard to tell if someone in your life is toxic. Do multiple people often say the same negative things about this one person? Do you agree with the group consensus? Or are you still unsure? Well, here are six ways to recognize a toxic person in your life. Number one, they're disrespectful of your time. Time is pretty much the most valuable thing we have. Is this person constantly late? And when they do show up, they don't give you an apology. Or do they talk over you the entire time? And you feel like it's nearly impossible to get a word in. Toxic people often make everything about themselves. You may feel like a brick wall in what was otherwise supposed to be a two-way conversation. If you find this is happening to you, maybe try spending more time with other people. Number two, lack of boundaries. If the person is toxic, they might also devalue your boundaries. Remember that it's okay to say no. You should never be made to feel guilty for needing a day away from everything. In many cases, this can be integral for your mental health. If this person calls and texts you multiple times asking to spend time with you and completely ignores your request for a day to yourself, that's kind of toxic. Your day doesn't revolve around one single person, and it shouldn't. It's important to place boundaries, especially at the start of a new friendship or relationship. Number three, jealousy of your success. When you do well on a test or get promoted at work, these are things that should be celebrated and cheered on. When you tell the person about your achievement, do they belittle it? Do you feel worse about yourself after having told them? People that are jealous of your success will go out of their way to criticize you and your work. This can be especially difficult to handle when it's a good friend or a close family member. Chances are the person is trying to knock you down a peg because they weren't able to accomplish a similar goal. Jealous people often project their failures and insecurities onto others. Number four, you feel like you're walking on eggshells. If you ever had to walk on eggshells around someone, it means you have to be very, very careful. Are you in a relationship with someone who makes you feel that way? It can be nothing short of exhausting. Relationships, whether they're romantic or platonic, are built on the same bedrock of principles, trust and honesty. If you don't have either, the relationship simply isn't sustainable. Do you have to second guess everything you say and do around them? This isn't healthy, nor is it fair to you. Number five, not taking responsibility. As human beings, we all make mistakes. Admitting you're at fault for something is never fun, but it can make your mind, body, and soul feel a whole lot lighter. A toxic person, on the other hand, is someone who never takes responsibility. This comes in all forms. Maybe they put the blame on you for their actions, or they make up excuses. Either way, refusing to take responsibility is one of the key traits of a toxic person. And number six, they're emotionally draining. If a person is an emotional drain on you, it's super imperative that you take stock of this. Toxic people will often latch onto others like a parasite. A parasite needs another host to survive. On a subconscious level, you may have already clued into the fact that they're toxic. There's a definite reason for this. On a phone, the battery drains faster when there are multiple apps and tabs open. A toxic person will likely feel like multiple apps all at once. Closing these will keep your phone running faster and longer. Apply this principle to your life. Give it a try. Thanks so much for watching. If you feel like you might be the one becoming toxic, we've got a video for that too.